the legendary 13th monkey of Montevideo. Arr, whose sacrifice will eternally bind the oceans themselves to my infernal will. Arr, arr. Rest yet. Half as much as I'll be when Guybrush guts your diseased carcass with his voodoo cutlass, you doddering sack of scum! I wouldn't hold your breath waiting for any last-minute heroics, dear. The last I saw of your mighty pirate husband, he was being torn apart by a school of my ravenous piranha poodles. All right, LeChuck, put down the monkey and back away from my wife. Guybrush! Arr! Three four. You've led me a merry chase, but soon the dread mysteries of these ancient simians will be mine, <laughs> and the seas will run red with the blood of my enemies. Har, har, har! <laughs> yeah, well, you fight like a... No time to waste, Guybrush. Finish enchanting that sword before LeChuck completes his spell. I'm on it. One LeChuck defeating cursed Cutlass of Kaflu coming up. Now, where did I leave those handy voodoo instructions? The pin to your mast! Oh, yeah. Come to Guy Brush, you spooky voodoo recipe, you. Well, I had to sail six of the seven major seas to find the ingredients, but I finally finished the cutlass. All right. Now all I need to do is find some fizzy root beer to spray on it, and let Chuck's as good as toast. Icky. My beautiful butter! What? I said, Elaine, my beautiful butter! My beautiful butter? I was gonna say buttercup, but you keep cutting me off! Oh, Guybrush! Now stop the chuckle, we're all dead! What's going on here? The chuck hijacked my ship and sailed to the Rock of Gelato to finish his terrifying voodoo ritual. It's a good thing we've got the cutlass of Kaflu on our side, or we'd be done for. Okay. I'm fine. Finish the recipe. Do you need anything? I said I'm fine. Just finish the recipe. Want me to get anything from the hole? I brought some pot stickers. No! Finish the recipe! Why do you keep shouting at me? I'm not shouting! I'm projecting! The recipe says I'm supposed to soak the cutlass in magical root beer, but I can't find any. Have you looked in that creepy monkey coffin? Right, because everyone keeps their magic root beer in a tiny monkey coffin. Look at him, all smug and oozing with voodoo. We'll see who's oozing after I finish my awesome voodoo spell. Don't worry about me! Ah, the legendary monkey casket of Kauai. I'll never forget the horrible hula of Hades I had to do to get this thing. Is this thing sloshing? Or words you don't want to hear when you pick up a coffin. how you open this thing. Aha! A seltzer bottle full of root beer. I haven't seen one of these since before I had a beard. Bet this stuff will work wonders on my cutlass. Whoa! This city! Meet your frosty carbonated maker, LeChuck. Arr! Come and get me, a dirty and oily dipper! Arr! Stop showboating and break a sword, Guybrush! I'm not showboating, I'm... Arr! Arr! Whoa! Oops. Now we're going to die. Again. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay, no problem. I just need to find a fresh supply of impossible-to-find voodoo root beer. I sure hope there's some on Elaine's ship, because mine's as dry as a bone. And not one of those wet bones. I'm talking a dry, dry bone. 
Secret of Monkey Island again? Nay, now I be after much darker secrets. Secrets buried deep within the entrails of the monkeys of Montevideo. <laughs> Monkey entrails, of course. How silly of me. What kind of secrets do these monkeys hold? Dark secrets. Powerful secrets. Secrets that will make me a demon pirate king. <laughs> arr, arr, arr. You know, it's nice to see that your repeated deaths and dismemberments haven't dampened your enthusiasm. You look like something the cat dragged in and spat up on the floor, LeChuck. Arr. My outer shell is meaningless, you fool. Within my decaying flesh courses more voodoo power than your pitiful mind can possibly imagine. Didn't you used to be a ghost? Or a demon? Or maybe it was a zombie? Ah, the evil of Lechuk is always evolving in new and terrifying ways, sheep good. Evil is always evolving. Why can't it evolve into something less but ugly? The Chuck. What? Would you mind releasing my wife? She gets a little cranky when she's tied up for more than an hour or so. Your wife? Nay, Elaine is destined to be my bride. Destiny, Shmestiny. Elaine's my wife, and she's not marrying you. He be starting to get on me nerves, Geekwood. Elaine. Oh, for pity's sake, just running through with a cutlass so we can all go home. As you wish, my love. I'm pretty sure she was talking to me. Listen, see this ring? It means that Elaine and I are married. Hitch, cohabitating, eternally betrothed, till death do us part. Got it? Till death do you part, eh? We'll have to do something about that. Testing. 